in the administration of President Carter in the late 70s. And here is one of the excerpts. In late 1949, another alien craft, another right, alien aircraft crashed in the United States and was recovered partly intact by the military. One alien survived the crash. The alien's language was translated by means of pictographs. It was learned that the alien came from the planet... Uh, from the, in the Zeta Reticular star system... The alien lived until June the 18th, 1952, when he died of an unexplained illness. So, uh, 21st of October, 9.31pm. I think it looks like Salem. Um, and I don't know why I put NC. North Carolina, maybe? Uh, witnesses, witness was driving with his... Uh, 20 year old son and he saw a lime green glow glowing triangle uh, the innermost edges were white graduation of colour he swooped down and stopped and then, then vanished and his son um her son has oh his son's got bad eyesight and he thought it was a roundish shape and it freaked him out so much he reported it to um it's called N-U-F-O-R-C, National UFO Reporting Center in New Mexico. It's also a report by husband and wife uh, driving south of Napizi, 25th of August, about 8.30, saw a bubble-shaped craft. Uh, it passed in front of them. Saw two ETs seated in the object. Husband described uh, greys, but... Uh, not grey, dressed in green uniforms, talking together before they spotted the driver and then they got off. Wife said the, the light come from inside the bubble type craft caught her attention and the ETs inside were facing each other and as her husband drove they looked directly at her and she waited a couple of minutes before saying did you see that? I just imagine it can um, Cas Casper, I think it is Wyoming, fourth of October. Yeah, so, so a, a truck driver saw a strange-looking grey creature standing beside the Interstate 25. Said it was about seven foot tall, dull grey, um, and had long arms. And he, he sped past it, and he said he was really, really scared. Twenty seventh of September, early morning, Atlanta bloke was uh, waiting for an insurance man to come um, to see the damage on his roof. Uh, when he, the insurance bloke, arrived, he was already looking at something in, in the sky, I think. No noise. Something very bright, silver colour, trailer shape. But like, took a photo. He vanished in the blink of an eye. And he said it was not of this world. Where was that? Atlanta. On a page called Galaxia, Galaxia Andromeda, the vid by suspect skies of, is an orb in LA, California, on the 28th of August. A helicopter comes circling it and then gets off, and the orb just stays uh, bold as brass. Um, it even looked brass, very, very shiny. Perfect sphere. Uh, Laura, I, I do like Laura. Laura Eisenhower. There's a vid called Laura Eisenhower Dissolved Draco Anarchy Reptilian Grey Matrix Renegotiate Secret ET Treaties. And she's talking to Alfred um, Lamberman uh, Weber, or Webre, um, published on the 6th of November. So it's really, it's only a couple of days old. Um, Cabal, they thought the New World Order had been placed by now. It's just false flags. Uh, what's going on? It's their final attempt. Uh, and that diocic crystal, I don't know. 70% are on board. Yeah, she said, we, the world's like, all right. She was very, um, it was good. Um, you know, 70% of the world has pretty much woke up. So she's. She was happy. Uh, there's all sorts coming out now about uh, paedophilia. Uh, and now it's our reaction to it, you know. 
to its emptying portal into new frequency, 0 0.0 alignment planetary 13. She was talking about the 13th gate connected to uh, zero point energy. Mm, heal, full on benevolence. Full on benevolence. That's what we've got now. Transhumanization has never been successful anywhere. Um, anywhere that's like anywhere in the universe. Yeah. So why are they trying it here? I don't know. Uh, there's a, a shift in humanity, and every power structure has been infiltrated. And she gets loads of grief for uh, what a great granddad did. What he went signing a treaty with ETs. Um, much more into unity consciousness, walk a path of integrity, be in alignment. Um, addiction matrix, that's what we're in now. Mass exorcism underway. Uh, unconditional love from source. No one's buying into the bad timeline. A1, artificial intelligence. A1's not A1. AI. AI. Um, yeah, it's bad, bad, bad. That's the agenda of the cabal. Um, she said, there's nothing more powerful than alchemy. Um, nothing more powerful than spirit. Sun's moved into the 13th sign. We don't know it. Um, all our knowledge was destroyed with the Templars. We're all wounded. Um, we all need to work on ourselves. Almost on... We're almost on the other side of the tipping point. She says, if you want to watch it or just anything, lauraeisenhower.com. Draco's Orion Gray's Anunnaki, third phase of me. Uh, well, so that's finished. And yeah, oh, was it quite really good, though. I would, I would definitely watch it again. Laura Eisenhower, Dissolve Draco Anunnaki Reptilian Gray Matrix, Renegotiate Secret ET Treaties with Alfred Weber good and third phase of the moon uh, what did they capture alien body has expert bewildered 11 8 17 so um what so it's only um would that be the 11th of august then it must be um 92 in 1992 in switzerland there was footage has come out that was on the dark web um of an, an ET and it was quite it wasn't nice really because they'd hung it up always like a washing line do you know what I mean some wire uh, to take photos of it and they're calling it an EBE footage around the dark web yeah different types of uh, EBEs or ETs uh, there was some burn it was burnt a bit um, these men look freaks the few men that was there in the pictures Secure team, they've uh, done a bit on it as same footage, and their vid's called This 1992 footage may prove aliens exist. Uh, ET biological entity, that's what E B E means. And the men are all dressed the same, like a blue uniform. ET found in a film, it was loads of snow, it had been snowing. Uh, yeah, the, it, was, it was gone the next day. Found outside Montreal, close to a river. Very, very human looking eyes. Um, you could see the Adam's apple trapezius muscle. Uh, the men apparently didn't want to touch it in case of contamination. Um, atomical features. Looks like it was wrapped up like a mummy in some photos. And yeah, that was really, really good. That published to YouTube on the 8th of November, Street Cap 1 has found something anomalous and is called a vid um, white rectangle found no, no white uh, yeah, rectangle rectangle found on the moon big white thing uh, with a dent in it yeah, that's all it is, big white thing with a dent in it but you know, he's there, he's found it he's only just found it as well so, cheers for that. Um, cheers for that. What's his name? George? Street Cap One, yeah. So, now I'm going to do what I always do. Because Andy Manion's not been writing 
I'm, I'm done for because it, there's there's not many places where I can go to get my stuff from, uh, and I like the way Andy Mannion writes. So if he doesn't write, uh, I can't do a lot. I'm going to do what I always do this time of day, especially for Mike Sexton out there in Cincinnati. I am I can wave in, and uh, Jason Gleaves is somewhere in Cheshire, and our very own Elvista. Here we go with Alien Six. Hello, baby. Take me to your leader. So it's crop circles now. And a DC to AC oscillator was drawn in crops near electricity towers in Ohio to explain how they, they convert the DC output of a homopolar generator into AC power. And September 20th, DC to AC oscillator with seven electromagnetics. Electromagnets, seven electromagnets. Hmm. And September the 1st, 1999, near Avebury, is a homopolar generator rotating magnets called self exciting homopolar generator. Mag- There's a vid called Magnetic River, and it's by Eric, it's, well, it's not by the bloke called Eric La- Lathway. Uh, Seg Rollers, S E G. And they're all patterns that are seen in crop circles. If you just Google magnetic river Eric Lathwaite, you'll know what I'm talking about. Electromagnetic proportion by a tubular induction motor by an AC electromagnet. In 2016, drawings in um, August near the White Horse in Wiltshire, spinning propeller resembles a 3D, three-phase permanent magnet AC induction motor with a rotating magnetic field yay and that's I'm not going to read that out again because I'm all reading that thing I? I've not got much to read 
But that was really, especially that last one. 